Hello, and welcome to a selection of Accounts Payables Tools presented by Profit Business Group. Do you need automated control over your payables process? Routing AP approval requests based on defined rules? Microsoft Dynamics GP has you covered with Payables Workflow Approvals. Workflows can be configured for vendors, batches, and payables transactions. Customizable email notifications are available. We'll take a look at submitting, approving, and recalling workflow requests, and also review the workflow history. Let's dive right in with a simple AP transaction approval workflow I've set up in Profit's test environment. The workflow rules are defined in the maintenance window. Here we can see vendor, batch, and transaction workflows available to configure, along with purchase order processing workflows. This transaction approval workflow is configured to require approval uh, from one person if the document amount is $5,000 or higher, from a different person if the document amount is between $1,000 and $5,000, and no approval is required for transactions below $1,000. Additionally, each approval step allows us to configure an email message to be sent to the approver. We can also include doc attached documents that have been added to the transaction in the email notification. Once an appropriate workflow is enabled, workflow options are available in the Payables Transaction Entry action bar. Here we can submit the transaction and include a comment for the, for the approver. I've submitted three transactions for three approval thresholds, under 1,000, between 1,000 and 5,000, and 5,000 or more dollars. We can view the pending approvals in the Workflow Payables Transaction Navigation List. Here we can see the $5,000 transaction is pending on one approver. The $1,000 transaction is pending for a different approver. And the under $1,000 transaction is not pending as it did not require approval. Requests can be approved, rejected, delegated, or recalled through this navigation list. Approval requests can also be approved, rejected, or delegated from the transaction itself. And once it's been approved, you can also recall from the menu bar. Furthermore, with some additional setup, approvals and rejections can be accomplished via the email notifications without even logging into GP. Reviewing the workflow history can be done from the action bar, both for unposted transactions in the transaction entry window or for posted transactions via the Payables Inquiry windows. The workflow history shows the submission details, including the comment, as well as the action required by each step of the workflow. For example, for 5K+, plus, there's no approval required, but in the 1K to 5K section, this one required an approval, which was performed by myself. If you would like to learn more about Accounts Payables workflows in Microsoft Dynamics GP, please visit Profit Business Group at www.profit.ca. Thank you, and have a great day.